What's up guys, Hill Josh here. Sorry I'm not posting that frequently here on YouTube. I'm always on Twitch and TikTok, but I am gonna be trying to be more active here on my YouTube channel. Appreciate all you guys getting me to 600 subscribers. There's gonna be more content coming. Thank you guys so much. I get asked all the time, Josh, we've seen your awesome uh, small, <laughs> I think it's small, pro wrestling figure collection. Do you collect anything else? And I do. Uh, surprisingly, I collect what's inside this bin right here. So I've had a lot of these for a long time. Uh, I've had them given to me by friends and family. But in this bin, this humongous bin here, is my wrestling magazine collection. I collect wrestling magazines. I have stuff in here from the 80s, the 90s. I don't know what the latest one I might have in here is, but I have a lot of stuff. I've kind of went in here recently, but uh, now we're going to do a deep dive. And I'm going to show you guys basically my whole magazine collection. <laughs> So here is a wide angle shot of the majority of the in good condition magazines I have. We have a lot of great magazines in here, a lot of ones that are there before I was even born. Um, a lot of these uh, were just ones that my brother and I purchased um, growing up or were given to me by friends and family just like, hey, do you want some wrestling magazines? I'm like, yeah, you know what, I'll take them. Um, and so yeah, these are the good kind. I also have some more right over here. We got some that are not in the best condition. but. We have some right there, and then also right here by my TV, I decided to put the stack that are damaged, uh, heavily damaged, but we have a whole other stack right there. But so many different wrestling magazines that I own. So a lot of these, like I said, are older than me. So this one looks like September 1987, Brutus Beefcake. You know, a lot of these are in actually very good condition that I have. Um, this is where we go, and you can see they would be selling CDs, and, or not CDs, tapes in this case, cassettes. You know, we got all kinds of different stuff. Official ratings. Look at this. Most hated Jim Cornette. This is 1987. Most popular Ricky Morton. Ricky Morton. Look at that. Rock and Roll Express Hogan. Steamboat. Dingle Warrior. Which is actually the Ultimate Warrior, by the way. Dusty Rose. Robert Gibson. Nikita Koloff. Terry Taylor. Bruce Beefcake. Some awesome stuff. Top 20 right up there. Tag teams. We got Rudin Fernandez. Road Warriors. Like, look at this. It's just... This is vintage wrestling magazines right here. This NWA Top, Barry Windham, AWA, Kurt Henning, WWF with Hercules. Wow, Hercules is right number one. Look at that. But yeah, these magazines are awesome. Look at that. <laughs> Michael P.S. Hayes right there. But yeah, man, I got a lot of really awesome old wrestling magazines. What do we got here? This is 1997, NWA Over. So this is where a lot of us got our news about inside information and stuff like that also a lot of these magazines do keep tape especially pro wrestling illustrated we got the wwf magazine from 1997 i believe this one is 98 yeah man these are all awesome what do we got here what year is this i don't know i don't see it anywhere but a lot of old magazine another pro wrestling illustrated from the 90s 98 99 on this one 98 brett brett screws brett so this covers montreal screw job now we got some more ratings and stuff here actually i'm sorry but yeah, and we got, of course, this one here, 98. Of course, got a just dedicated John Michaels one. Another pro wrestling. Oh, look at that. See, look, there's a lot of good magazines I have here. Uh, when Ash went to WCW, so it's not in the best condition. What do we got here? Just departments again. We got a PWI. This one's damaged, but 500 ranking right here. It looks like one of the magazines. Let's see who was number one. I don't know what year this was, but we're going to see who came out number one in this magazine. I don't keep getting caught in other stuff here. Come on, where is it? Where is it? Number one, okay, number one, where is it? I'm trying to find it. Number one, Dean Malenko. What the fuck? Dean Malenko, Missoua, obviously. Steve Austin came in at third, Dallas Page at fourth. And it, reason that there's missing stuff, as you can see, this was an Undertaker one that my brother and I would cut out and make posters when we go to events. Wow. Hashimoto, Giant. Liger. What number is Liger? Is that the top 10? Uh, 8. So Liger's 9. Sorry, I didn't see the 9. And then Ben Wallace, 10. And wow, what a list for the PWI 500. I didn't know Dean Malenko was number 1 at one point. But we got a ton. And this is, which was this, 91? This has to be in the 90s. Uh, what does it say? Oh, right there. 1991. I was actually, this is a month before I was born. Ooh, look at WCW versus WF. Yeah, so I have tons and tons of wrestling magazines. Uh, 
A lot of them in pretty good condition, as you see. This is this one. Let's see, date November 91. a little baby. Oh, hello, Sable. Inside Wrestling with a great cover there. Another Inside Wrestling. How old is this one? I don't see a date. Oh, September 1987. Right there. Oh, we got like a little off the top rope little comic book here. And this right here, I wanted to show you guys. So this is how we used to order like figures. Actually, no, this is more recent. Cause look, at it. I have this. I fucking have this. So I thought this was older, but this is how a lot of us used to order stuff was via the magazines. I actually thought this was a lot older than it is. Oops, I had to swing the right way. But yeah, so that's kind of how we would use it then. And then we have more over here. What ones do we got? Here we have more Pro Wrestling Illustrated, the best of the best. What year was this? July 92. This one damaged a little bit. It's older. I don't see June 1992. We won, so this is essentially like the ratings war. Sting, of course. But yeah, guys, so this is essentially my whole collection. Like, it's really cool. Like, a lot of these. I guess that's the only top 500 one I got. There are quite a few for us in this right now. I said we got these. A lot of these are damaged, so they're missing covers and, and pages and stuff like that. But. So many magazines. Like here's the record of the crowd. Like what is this? I have no idea. Just different magazines that I have of wrestling. Just so much. So here we go. This is how we used to order toys and all of our stuff is through uh magazines, like X-ray vision goggles we could have ordered. Focus bitch. But yeah, a lot of stuff. So it's in this one. Let's just open up another one here. Lot of black and white, no color. When is it? See, I don't even know if I have a date on this one then. May 1999, actually. That one looks a lot older. This is Wrestling Confidential. Here's this. Does have a date? This one's pretty damn Yeah, but as you can see, that is essentially the whole collection, guys. So that's basically my whole wrestling collection. If there's a YouTube video idea that you want me to do, please put it in the comments down below. Also, if you haven't followed me across all of social media, I have a Discord that you could join. Uh, you could follow me on TikTok, Twitter, Instagram, Twitch, where I game all the time. I do live reactions to all of the main WWE shows, NXT, AEW, all the pay-per-views. I've been watching Impact Wrestling on there. I've been watching ROH on there. So twitch.tv forward slash hilljosh, best place to go. I'm always on there. As well as the TikTok, we're getting close to 100,000 followers on TikTok. Thank you guys for 600 subscribers here on YouTube. So click that link tree down below to join all of my other social medias. And thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.